So I said there were three behaviors, right? And the behavior that we're left with are the 90s. And they're not called the 90s because they were born in the 90s. They're called the 90s because they represent 90% of your consumer base or of the people who you interact with in open social channels. In contrast with the ones and the nines, these guys are lazy as fuck. They're not really interested in collaborating with you at all. They just want entertainment from you. And when I say entertainment, I mean entertainment in the broad sense. They want to feel stuff when you contact them. They don't want to interact with you. They might feel like, you know, I can like a post or I can, if it's really, 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 really juicy, I might be there to share this post. But a 90 is there to consume whatever it is you, you, uh, you've posted. And so uh, your work is really getting, you know, creating the content in collaboration with the ones, making it appeal to the nines by, you know, pitching it to them so they find some self-interest in it. Because then the 90s, you know, reaching out through all these networks, the 90s will just be there to ent be entertained. As an example, on YouTube, only 20% of the views actually happen on the YouTube platform. So in order for you, know, you to get the rest of the 80%, uh, what you have to do is to get outside of the YouTube platform, into people's blogs, into news magazines, into all these other places where other 90s, other groups of 90s will kick back and have a good time to watch your content. So 90s are your consumers. These are the guys who are there to buy based on recommendations. They're not willing to put in the work needed in order to actually figure out what is the best choice. So if you figure out a way to collaborate with your nerds and your connectors, then the 90s will you know, increase in size and that's how you sort of get growth going. So the 90 behavior is not that they're not interested in your product, but they're not interested enough to interact with you. So if your goal is to get virality and you, you know, focus on targeting everyone with your messaging, what you will see is that you will have very, 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 very small engagement rates as a result. Now, if you focus on the ones and the nines on the other hand, then your engagement rates will go up. And if bringing that back to that algorithm discussion, when engagement goes up, the algorithms think that your stuff is the juiciest shit. And so the algorithm becomes your, uh, uh, you know, algorithmic nine, so to say, and bringing your content to a lot of the 90s. Now, I'm sure that you start to think right now, so how, how, how can I actually do this? And we will get into that as we get into activation, how to activate these different behaviors and make them grow. But for now, just remember that 90% of the people you actually reach are not really interested in engaging with you. And so you have to respect that and think of ways in which you can create content that actually appeals to people from an entertaining perspective. And as I said, entertainment does not mean, you know, ha ha ha, laugh, but it means about creating feelings, positive and negative within people so that they do not dislike your content. Because that positive association with your content will then be a positive association with your product. And that will bring up your conversion rates as we will get into just in a matter of a few more videos. So those are the 90s, the consumers.